Jacobs, everybody. Julian Jacobs. Amazing. Have you been doing hot yoga? <laughs> I used to do hot yoga, but then I felt like I was going to faint every time, so I stopped. So do you stop doing yoga completely, or do you just do room temperature yoga or even cold yoga? <laughs> I've not tried cold yoga. I mainly just stress myself out, and I feel like I kind of work my muscles just by being tense all the time now. No, baby, no. No, it's not good. No, no, you got to relax. Okay. Do, do that thing. Okay. Keep doing that. All right. All right. <laughs> How are you otherwise? You I'm good? wonderful. How are you? Oh, yeah, I'm all right. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm a bit vegan right now, though. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. And the cheese is hurting your tummy? No, no, no. It's okay. not, it just makes me say Louisville for some reason. <laughs> I, do you, have you ever d done anything like that? Any kind of dietary thing? Well, living in L.A., if you don't, you're kind of the odd man out. Right, that's right. Yeah. Oh, you ate something? Oh, gross. Yeah, so I think I'm one of the only actresses I know that still eats bread, so... You eat bread? I'm a freak! Oh, my God, I love you! I'm such a freak! Where are you from? I'm from Pittsburgh. That's why you still eat bread, yeah. they say. They wouldn't let I'm me back. I'm going to Pittsburgh next week. You are? Yeah. What are you going to do? I don't know. Tell me what I should do in Pittsburgh. Well, everyone should say that you should go to Permani Brothers. Oh, but that doesn't really work for you now that you're vegan. Well, they must have some bread. Yeah, they definitely have some bread. Right, they and... put French fries in their sandwiches there. Well, that's all right. All they right. do that in Scotland, too. Oh, okay, they do? Oh, yes. Really? Yes, they have the worst heart attack rates in Europe. <laughs> yeah, wait till you get to Pittsburgh. Yeah, well, you see, you've got to be careful, though, with all the fat and the... Uh, no, it's not yeah. good. I have to be careful now, because I'm old. No, you're not. Yes, yes, I'm almost 70. <laughs> Well, you look Ay, caramba. great for 70. Thank you very much. I really like the way you said that. Can we leave that in? <laughs> you know, all over America, people would be very happy if the, you let... You're a racist, man. <laughs> I'm sorry, he's a racist. They won't let you say that in the air, but it sounded good. Thank you. What's happening with community? Now it's no, not on... I know. It's not on NBC. It's now on... On Yahoo. Yahoo! Yahoo! That's the one everybody wants to be on. Exactly. Uh, they seem to like us a lot, so it's well, a change they... for us. Yeah, no, because NBC, they didn't seem to... No, I think... Everybody loved that, that show, except NBC. NBC. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think you had some harsh words for NBC the last time I was here. Your parting oh, shot really? across the bows. What did yeah. I say to them? It was an indictment of them as a network, I felt like. Really? I feel differently now, now that I have unemployment looming. <laughs> Would you ever want to do a show on Yahoo? They've been so nice so far. Yeah, all right. All right. I are you like are you empowered to yeah, ask? Yeah, exactly. Me? Well, they they empowered me today before. Did I they came. send you here? Yeah, they said I'm actually a secret emissary to offer you a Yahoo talk show. Um. Well, I I'd, I'd love to. And yes. Okay, great. Well, so long, suckers. <laughs> Tell me. Um, Tell me, I'm going to say, tell me about the movie, and then I was going to say, tell me about your shoes. Hi. Say, wow, hello. Yeah, I know. Hello, I'm a little tied up, but I'm... <laughs> I know, I'm so surprised that I didn't fall walking over here. I can actually walk in these. Yeah, they're, they're good. Thank you so much. Yeah, no, they're very sick. <laughs> your socks aren't bad. These are tights because, oh. uh, I'm, because I'm cold, because I've, uh, I'm a vegan now. <laughs> uh, we get cold a lot. Tell me about the film. You play a lesbian? No, I do not. Lady oh. Meester does. I play the straight one in our friendship. Yes. Right. And we're inseparable best friends. We're very codependent. We do everything together. We've never really been in significant relationships. I get a boyfriend. Kind of causes some tension in our friendship. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Mm -hmm. And then you go nuts and rob a bank? That would be so wonderful. That's the sequel. That's right. That's the sequel. And no. then aliens come down. Yeah, and... and then a volcano explodes. Did you ever see that movie with a volcano with Pierce Brosnan? No, but I saw Joe versus the volcano with the Tom, uh, Tom Hanks. Hanks. Yeah, yeah, that was when they were going to throw the lady into the volcano. Is that what? I, I don't even remember anything about the movie other than the wonderful title. I, I remember there was one called uh, Dante's Peak yes. with Pierce Brosnan, and they were like, everyone was like, the volcano's going to go, and I was like, why don't you all just leave town? Did they they were like, I don't know. It looks like she's going to go. I was like, let's get in the car and get out of here before the Ooh -la -la. volcano goes on. Is that what? 
Can you say? Can I, no, no, that one won't stay either. Hey, uh, have you ever been to a volcano? No, I never have. You, you should go to one. I've okay. been to one, uh, Mount Etna in oh, Sicily. Yeah. You ever been to Italy? Yes, when I was very little, we were robbed on the train from Nice to Venice, so it wasn't a great trip. You were robbed? Yes, our whole train was robbed. By outlaws? By Italian train thieves, they actually... This is the greatest story I've ever heard. <laughs> this, this you should do a movie about. I mean, it's all right with lesbians and stuff, but come on! You're on the train, there's an American family on the train, and suddenly yeah. it's like, hey, what's the coming to go? Hold up the train! Well, I wish it was that exciting, but apparently they drugged us. What? Yes. <laughs> what? Yes. So you guys are all like, oh, like that, and then they go, okay, everybody's creeping through the train. I take off all the necklace. Really? Sadly, yes. I woke up to my dad screaming, we've been robbed. Oh, no. Yes. And then your dad goes on a mission of vengeance to find your stuffy toy that you can't sleep without. They... Look, you're crying. It's such a great idea. You're kidding, but they stole my Game Boy games, which was devastating to what? me at the time. This is a terrible story. Yes. So apparently someone else, they, uh, there was a British woman who was writing an article about Italian train thieves. So she and her husband were taking turns staying up all night, feeling like it might happen. So the guys came into their compartment, grabbed their suitcase, and her husband chased the train thieves down the hallway, and they're rifling through the bag as they're running, and they go, oh, you don't have it. I can't do an Italian accent. Pretend it's Italian accent. You don't have anything great, and threw it back. He didn't pursue them further, but yeah, they robbed our whole train. How did they administer the drugs to get you to fall asleep? They said, this sounds ridiculous, but it's true. They said they apparently sprayed something in our room that made us all knock out and not wake up because, oh, they were also in cahoots with the train conductors. So oh. they had the keys. <laughs> I didn't even see that coming. I know. I didn't even see it coming. I know. They had the keys to all of our train compartments. Oh, no. Yes. really should do a movie about this. On Yahoo! Screen. Yeah, on Yahoo! Coming soon! Go and take it!